everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Anna, and today's video is going to be a bathroom tour. Um, I really don't do these a lot. I usually do these all the time back when I first started this channel, but my bathroom really hasn't changed over the years. Um, you know, a bathroom's a bathroom. You can't really, like, change up much unless you paint it and put, like, new decoration or whatever in it, but I don't do that. My house is old, but... Here's the door, yes, in case you are new, my bedroom, I now have a bathroom in my bedroom, this is the master room, but I've done a room tour previously, if you want to see like a full glimpse of my room, um, it's a very small room, my parents let me have it, I am not special or nothing, I don't get special treatment from my parents, oh, because I begged for this room, I did not beg for this room, um, my parents, their stuff cannot fit in here, like they have a bigger bed than I do, their big bed will probably fit in here, but they wouldn't have any much room for anything else. They have a lot more furniture. It barely fits my stuff in here, so I got stuck with this room, which we live in a small house. So, yeah, pretty much. But here is the door. The doorknob. The doorknob's been off. I have tape right there because, you know, with the knob not being there, you can see through it. It, it gives everybody that uses my bathroom privacy. Um, me privacy, even though I'm mainly the only one that uses it. Um, if I have friends over, it gives them privacy because, you know, nobody wants to see nobody else using the bathroom, you know. But anyways, this right here is my initial A and B. Um, somebody made me this several years back. We're not actually, we used to be close friends, but like, a lot of stuff happened. Um, we've been not friends for a while. But she made me this. I really like it. I, she gave it to me. Um, it had peace sign and all that on it, so it's really pretty. So I just left it on my bathroom door. You know, I wasn't going to throw it away. So, as you open the door, my bathroom is pretty small. Um, so I'm going to turn the light. So let me come in here and close the door. On well, the back of the door, I don't have anything. Um, I was thinking about putting something like stickers or something on the back of it, but I haven't done that. Over here, I have this sign, which my Nana got me, I think. When we first moved in this house, which has been about six years ago, six and a half years ago, I think, um, she helped me redo my room. Uh, basically, right after we moved in, she came and helped me put everything up on my walls and straighten up my room and everything, so she brought this. I, I don't remember this being our last house, but I think she brought this the day that she came. It says, a daughter will make love stronger, days shorter, heights, nights longer, bait rope, I cannot speak that, bait rope, <sighs> bank roll smaller, home happier, clothes shabbier, the past forgotten, the future is worth living for, anonymous. So that's really pretty. So I have that right there. Over here, I have my closet door, which I'm not going to open that because my closet is a mess. Um, yeah, my closet is in my bathroom. This is where actually my clothes go. I really don't go in here as much because basically all it has is my pants and my long sleeves and jackets and all that. It's mainly what all is in there. And my shorts and short sleeve shirts, tank tops, whatever. They're in my chest drawers in my room. So that is my closet door. And moving over here is my sink a lot of stuff happens at this sink um <laughs> where i get ready most of the mornings like brush my hair brush my teeth do if i'm gonna put a little makeup on i'll put a little makeup on that's basically what all happens right here so i'm gonna go down here it's a kind of a mess down here but not really you can't really see it i have like my pads and everything like that and i got shampoo bottles everywhere and my face stuff some of it so you can't really tell, but you can see a little bit. Over there is my toilet scrubber. On top, I just organized this. I cleaned my bathroom earlier today, and I wanted to reorganize some stuff. I'm not really sure if all this is going to stay here, because I'm kind of like debating should I change some stuff up. But in this little bowl right here, I have some rubbing alcohol. Um, basically I use this for to put on Q-tips like to clean my ears with or like when I'm wearing earrings I'll put some on this cap so I can like sterilize the earrings before I put them in. So I have that there. 
This is my soap dispenser, which I when I wash my hands. Soap's in there. I have my headband. I have my floss sticks. Over here I have my ponytails. This is my makeup bag, which just has my face powder, my mascara, my eyeshadow on the bottom of it as well. Over here is an old candle. You see warm apple pie. Basically, I can't light it anymore. Um, so, I just them around because it still has some in it. It still smells some, so I just keep it right there. Over here is like, especially like a necklace holder or bracelet holder, but you know, it's a whole bunch of old ponytails and everything. So, somebody gave me this. I think two of my cousins gave me this as a present several years back. So, thank you. Um, here is my cup, which basically I keep my mouthwash, my toothpaste. I just keep these little things in here. I never open this, but you know, these are fingernail files. These are floss sticks that I got from the dentist before I got those over there. I didn't never open and use them, but that's why I got from the dentist. This is also another thing of toothpaste. That's what the dentist gave me when I went to go get my teeth cleaned. I hate that kind of toothpaste. I like my normal. Here's like, I think I said like a file or whatever, I don't know, and there's like a hair clip in there, so. A lot of stuff in there. Mainly I just use this in my mouthwash. That's all I use that's in this coat. Everything else is in there too. Because I really don't have no space to put it. So. Yeah, so now I'm going to put that back over there. Over here, I have a, another candle. I just burnt this one. This one won't lie anymore either. This is the hazelnut cream. I really don't have nowhere to put it, but you know, it still kind of has a little smell to it, so I just put it right here. Over here is my toothbrush holder. This is the toothbrush I use right now. That's my backup one that I used before. Then here is my cup, which I rinse my mouth out and stuff with when I'm brushing my teeth. So that is my sink. Top of it. Over here, moving over here, is my window. Um, I have my little curtain up there. And right down here is my trash can. And I have my, what's it called, toilet paper. And over here is my towel rack. So down here, it just has some, well, I'm going to show you guys that in a minute. Up here is like some old towels. I never really use these towels. These are like hand towels that I like wipe my hands down with after I wash them or wipe, or uh, dry my face off over here is some a whole bunch of different they have scrunchies and stuff like i am not a visco girl like i really never use these scrunchies at all um but i have a whole bunch of ponytails and all that here down in the middle i have towels that i use at night when i'm after i get out of the shower then down here i have my basket which usually, some of this stuff, I just put in here, as I said, when I was remodeling everything. I have my hairbrush. I have my deodorant. I have my detangler. This is my face stuff. Which, if you want to know what kind of face stuff I'm using. I have another bottle, but I, I still have some in here. It is the Differin Gel. It works pretty good on my face. And over here, sometimes that Differin does dry my skin out when it's trying to dry up stuff. So I have this face cream that's supposed to help dry skin. And it wants to open. Put that back in here. So over here is my speaker, which basically I just put my old phone on and listen to music while I'm in the bathtub. I'm thinking about just having it right here. Since I used to have it right over there where that tub is, since I put that there. Um, I'm just going to have it right here. I can still hear it pretty good whenever I have it in there. I like listening to music and stuff when I'm in the shower. There's the toilet. And over here is the shower. I got this shower curtain for Christmas. It was in my Christmas haul. I'll try to put it in the car above or down below if I if I remember why I'm adding this video. These are the two rugs I also got for Christmas. That's supposed to kind of match. You know, gray kind of matches with that, in my opinion. And as you are opening it, there's my tub. I have my 
shampoo, I have my stopper, I have my bar soap, and I have my body soap. I have a cup, which sometimes I wash my hair with. I have my razor, and I have my shaving cream. That's mainly all I keep in there. So that is basically it for my bathroom tour. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. And as I said, I really don't do these videos often where I show you guys my bathroom because nothing really changes. If you go back, if I put like a old bathroom tour down that I filmed several years ago, basically everything looks the same, mostly. Um, except for a few things might be different that I don't have in here. Like there was like a mirror or something right there, I think, that I had at one point. I'll try to put that video down below so you can kind of tell what it looked like about a year or two after we moved in so yeah that is basically it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys in my next video bye everybody